You have a license, sir? No, you can't ask for that unless I'm committing a crime, man. What's wrong with you? Well, you're acting suspicious here. You better, uh, California, no, you're California Pina Code. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. For what? California Pina Code 148.G. I'm doing a story on your police department, and now you're going to be, anything from here on, you're going to get charged by the minute. You better get a hold of supervisor. First Amendment protected activity. You're not going to get no ID, okay? 148.G and four dives versus Seattle. You still want to detain me? Here's the thing. I don't care. Listen. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. Go get a supervisor or arrest me. And you're gonna get sued. I'm doing a First Amendment lawful protected activity. I'm keeping account you accountable. I'm here to make sure you're doing your job. And right now you're you're about to violate my civil rights because you're detaining me and I'm not doing anything criminal. Thank you, sir. Have a good day. Denied. The government got shut down. No, I'd rather not put my window down. Window down now. Oh, he's yelling. Roll your windows down now. I refuse to put my window down. Roll your windows down. Yo, is you serious, bro? Roll your windows down now! No! Oh, oh, you. Why are you grabbing my doors like that? What are you doing? Open the door! No! Roll down that window so you can talk to me. My window is down so you can talk to me. It's not my fault he's scared to approach. You got guns, you got your hands on guns and you expect me to just... No, that's fucking crazy. Yeah, man. Y'all sitting here looking like y'all ready to shoot me. You mad because I won't roll the window down some more? Come up here. You just walked up here. Why is he scared to walk up here? That's bullshit, man. Fuck out of here. Now you don't got no problem walking up here. What are you doing, man? What are you doing, bro? You got, bro, I was, I was about to roll my window down. And I sit there. You put your window down with you your gun on your head. You know how many times head. I asked you before I even went for my gun? You hear how dumb you sound? <laughs> Look at this bullshit. This fucking shit. Where's this goddamn pig at? I'm pretty good, but I'd be I'd be happier if you go over there and move your car from the red curb in the fire hydrant. Damn, son. What makes you so special? You think you can just park there where nobody? I know you're not. That's why I came in here to ask you to go move your car. He's a good boy. Does whatever I say. Okay. That's right. Let's go. Go move that shit. Go move your shit from the red curb, man. Let's go. Park in the fire hydrant. Somebody gotta hold you accountable. So what's this? Have a date night on uh, on duty? Oh yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll sit down. What's your name? Um, so so you just think it's okay to just park at the red curb and uh, have a date night on? On duty, in my bag, with my girl's arm around me and everything else. Yeah, that's what I thought. What's your name? You got my name on the Guerra. Sounds like a real asshole. Don't ever let me catch you doing that shit again. All right, friend.
You want to roll down your window so I can explain this to you? I can hear you just fine. Okay, well, I'm going to need you to sign it. So yeah, You can fit it right there. I can see that at the width right now. No, I wouldn't like to roll down my window, please. Go ahead and step please. out of the car and we'll talk about it. Do, am I being detained? Yeah, you're being detained. For what I'll crime? Serve this ticket to you. Oh, I, I, I can, I can see the ticket right here. Excuse me, can I need, I would like to, I'd like to speak to a supervisor. I need a supervisor on this scene immediately, please. My supervisor, but the Supreme Court has ruled that I can have this traffic stop take place wherever I want. And it's happening. It's taking place. It's taking place. I can sign. I can sign that. If you do not step out of your car, so I can explain the citation to you, then you're going to be obstructing my investigation. This is an illegal stop. What, what am I? What are you stopping me for? Or your license plate and I'm accepting the citation. Okay. I'm going to need you to step out and there. sign it. And I'm not I can sign it. Window there, there. What? there just, I can have my window. Reach my hand in your window. Okay? You don't need to reach. Put the, the clipboard through my window. I'm, I'm telling you. You're not. You're no, you just said you're asking me. Why am I ordered to step, step out of a vehicle? Because I'm going to have you sign This right is illegal here. what you're doing. I need no, to speak with a supervisor. Call 911. Call 911. This is illegal. What is your name and badge number? Becker. A. Becker. You can easily put this through my window right here. Right. You have no reason to pull me out of this vehicle. You have no probable cause for any search. I do not I'm consent not to any searches. You. I am not your friend. You are a police officer who's illegally conducting a traffic stop right now. I, I demand a supervisor here immediately. And you have no legal right to pull me out of this vehicle. Supervisor here, friend. And yes, I do have every legal right. To have you. I have not committed any crime. You have not accused me of committing any crime. This is... You're Stop pulling me while I'm getting a supervisor, okay? You're You're to, you're pulling me over for a, a a registration. Exactly. I explained that to you. I'm not okay, and what was the you saw that in the middle of the night out here on the country road? What is the reason for pulling plate. you? You ran my plate. That's a yeah, you just said you ran my plate. That's a violation of my fourth amendment right. You cannot just run my plate without reasonable suspicion of me committing a crime. That, that is illegal. That's literally a hundred percent incorrect. That is unconstitutional. What, for you to run my plate without without reasonable suspicion of a crime. And I'm accepting the citation. You can hand it through my window. You're saying that if I put this clipboard through here, you're going to sign the ticket and we yeah. can all just get out of here? Yeah, that's what I've been saying the entire time. I'm not going to bite your hand. I don't bite. I mean, unless you really want me to. <laughs> Do you really feel uh, threatened by handing a clipboard through somebody's window, or is it really just about you no, having not gonna reach claiming control you. control over me and having me step out of the side of the car so you can okay. conduct Once another again, investigation? I have every legal right to do that, but <laughs> you would have already broke really, my window. If you did, really you would have feel. I just don't really feel like talking to you anymore. I see. It. Okay. Well, if that were the case and you actually had a legal right, you would have broke my window and tased me by now. But I, you know, you'd be I sued have for that. Absolutely no desire well, to do that. Oh, right. Well, I would just want to let you know. I have no desire to prolong this contact. Which well, is why I'm not having you step out of this. Because you have no legal right to. And I just want to verbalize that I'm signing this under duress, under extreme duress. Well, verbalize anything you want. My guess is you should uphold your oath to the Constitution and treat uh, free citizens like they're supposed to be treated. Tyrant. How many cops does it take for a public photographer? Do what? How many cops do it take for a public photographer? Well, we're just trying to see what you're doing, man. Walking around filming everybody with a gun on tail. That's totally legal. I don't county property, I don't, I don't think that is a public property. Right, it's just county it's just property. Which is county. It's just public property. Okay. Call your supervisor. Before you sign your name on the dotted line on the lawsuit, call your supervisor. This is county, this is public property. This is county property. It's public. This is tax it is. pay. It's, well, if you don't think so, I need you to know so. Because these are my rights you're about to violate. So I need all y'all to be sure that what you're finna do is legal, okay? Because I can film in public as long as I want to. And there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight cops out here. And you got your hand on your gun for what reason? Oh, it is hard goddamn work being this good. For my safety. Are, are you ready to shoot me? No, I'm not. So why you got your hand on your gun? Because no. I can. Because you're ready okay. to shoot me, right? No. Guns are made to shoot. <laughs> Tell me it's not you, Elmer Fudd. Y'all are a joke. No, no, no. It's a matter of fact. Your the hands issue are on is, your the gun. Issue is not here I'm done family. talking to you. The issue is you open carry. Which is legal in this state. Not here on this county property. This is public property. Is I can't carry property. inside of there. That's a government building. Right. Exactly. Park. I'm outside. This is a public area. What's in your name? Lot. Tell me your name. It's Detective Williams. Detective Williams. Yeah. Your badge number? 
we don't have badge don't have numbers. Badge numbers. No. So what you're telling me right now is, per the Constitution, I cannot open carry or film in none of this area. Per the county policy. Per the county. Oh, so but policy isn't law. I need you to understand that policy isn't law. Hey, what, hey man, what's your name? I don't. I'm not giving that out. I haven't broken the law. Well, I want to know what to refer to you as. Good citizen, please. <laughs> Good citizen. Yes, sir. Okay. Well, the reason we are here is uh -huh. because it is abnormal for somebody to open carry on county property. No. <laughs> As this, with that opening statement, I, I, listen, I would much rather talk to you, but I need this officer to understand okay. that he's threatening my life with his hands. He's not threatening his And he has the top of it. I hey. need y'all to see this, okay? Hey, he's going to took the top off his gun. He's ready to shoot me for no reason. Him. Yes, sir. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm trying to be cordial with you because yes, I am sir. super. My right. keys are right here. I'm cold. I'm putting my hand right here, okay? I don't want you shooting for no reason. Hey, can you talk to me? Yes, sir. Okay. I am the supervisor. Yes, sir. The county parking lot, it is county property, but the parking lot is public. You are right about that. Damn right. Yes, sir. But it is abnormal for people to walk around the parking lot with an open carry pistol. It is abnormal. You have to admit that it is abnormal. But is it legal? It doesn't matter whether it's legal or illegal. Is it legal? <laughs> I just want to answer my question. Also. But you're the supervisor, so you should know this more than anybody. Is it legal? It is legal. Yes, it is Can legal. Can I have your name? Oh, I'm sorry. I got that already. Are Can you I have your name? Are you going to listen to me? Have your name. What's the name first? Uh, I want your name first. It's your policy. Can I have your name? It's my policy to give yes. you my name? Yes. You do. Because you're in uniform, so you have to identify yourself. Right. Corey Payne. Corey Payne, thank you. All right. Any of y'all detaining me? Anybody detaining me here? All right. Since you're not going to be rational and talk to me, we're going to leave. Thank you. Bye. Don't do anything illegal. Woo, you just got schooled, son.